What do we hope listeners take away from this audio book? My hope is that this is seen for what it was intended to be. And that is a motivational book. Something that shows that hardships come with the territory. Nothing worth having is going to come easy. But if you strive, if you persevere, if you surround yourself with loved ones who are determined to lift you from whatever abyss exists in your life and to uplift you to a point where you can ultimately succeed and excel, then anybody can be me. I've been blessed and fortunate to achieve great things in my life, uh, things that I never dreamed possible, uh, financial gains that I never deemed possible, a quality of life that I never deemed possible. And it all happened because of the grace of God, the greatest mother that I think any human being could ever have, and a support group that was unquestionably committed to helping me ascend to new heights. I did not do this alone. Um, and when you have those things in place, you can truly, truly achieve anything. But understand, in order to have those things in place, you have to have an innate belief in yourself and a willingness to put in the work. Nobody's going to care for you more than you care for yourself. And you've got to recognize that and remember that and use that as a source of motivation to inspire and propel you to heights unseen or never dreamed of. You can get left back. You can have dyslexia. You can be deemed dumb and ignorant. You can have all of these maladies or all of these, you know, critics pointing their finger at you, willing to bring you down. But you can still pull off being me anyway. I, Stephen A. Smith, it's a very obtainable thing. You can achieve it if you believe it and you're willing to put in the work to make it happen.